Hello, and welcome to Mug of the Day. I want to welcome you back to an old school Mug of the Day. This is OG. This is an OG episode. Back in the days when I would just turn the camera on and start talking, I soon realized that I wasn't very articulate and I couldn't speak very extemporaneously. It takes me a while to think of the words I want to say sometimes. Early onset, early onset, early onset. Serum asshole. But enough, but enough about, about my, my mental, mental condition. condition. Check out this mug. This mug was given to me. This mug was given to me. This mug was this mug was given to me. As a high profile social media influencer, you sometimes receive free things. Free things. Free things. As a high profile social media influencer, you're sometimes given free things because, like me, look at this mug. It looks like a little tiny crock pot. Like me, I think it's stoneware. Like me, since I don't have a script, I'll just be speaking um yeah. Extemporaneously. 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 This mug, um, so like I'm just gonna kind of free flow with this, stream of consciousness on this mug today because like I say, I didn't write my ideas down, I didn't pin a review of this mug. Uh, I just picked it up and we're gonna take a look at it and you and I together are going to explore what makes this mug special okay and I'm just going to use um, what's those things you say um, when you're conveying thought to somebody else um, I'm just going to use the words I can think of okay right here on the spot so this mug as you can see the um, the handle thingy thing is on the left okay um, uh, it appears to me you can um, you know um, when you put liquid from one thing into another thing you can you pour you can pour it <clears throat> excuse me right into there pour it um, the, it's shaped in such a way that you can, um, once your liquid or your whatever is in there, um, that thing where you hold it up to your lips and kind of put a little bit in your mouth, um, drink. Yeah, you can drink right out of this, this mug, um, I feel like. Uh, it's, um, oh, dang it. That one that's round, the shape, shape, the shape that's round, um, it's round. It's round. That's, that, yeah. Sometimes I just think of the word and, and I'm saying it and it's round. Um, and it's, um, you know, um, uh, not deep, um, shallow, shallow. You could wade through it with your ankles probably. Um, it's, uh, I think it's um, made out of uh, ceramic, ceramic. Um, I think it's stoneware, stoneware. Um, at least it would appear to be. Um, I'd have to uh, heat it up in the, um, oh shoot, what's that thing? You put the cake in there, you turn the knob, it gets hot. Um, uh, stove, oven, oven. I, stoneware can withstand higher temperatures than a typical ceramic, um, so we'd have to see about that. Um, um, like I say, this is, we're just talking. We're just, just, I'm just, uh, uh, just explaining thoughts as they come to me. Um, uh, 
Wow, there's words on the bottom. There's a word on the bottom. Got to get my um, C, C thingies. Uh, this thing here. Um, I still can't make out what it says. There is a number one. I can't tell where it's made or when it was made. I'm very, very, um, oh shoot. Very, um, when you're apologetic, what's, when, you, when you feel bad and you want to express that to somebody, you say, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I can't make out what's on the bottom. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Um, that's um, what I think. Oh, this handle I noticed has a little bit of um, it doesn't connect on both sides. So that's different. It's kind of like um, what do you call that thing when um, like you tie it on the end of your fishing line and you put it in the water and you, you it's like uh, uh, you know um, you want to grab something that's far away maybe it's got that thing on it um, that thing it's like if you're fishing it's real sharp and it can poke you um, uh, what is it uh, hook it's like a hook, it doesn't go all the way around. That means there's some whimsy. This mug handle has a little bit of whimsy. I like the word whimsy. Um, um, hmm. This mug, this mug. It's got a lot going on, a lot of things. I got a lot of thoughts about this mug, a lot of thoughts. Um, can't believe. I can't believe how many thoughts I have about this mug. This mug. Yeah. Well, now we need more. We need more. This one I should have wrote down. I should have wrote this one down. Um, we need more. Like, like baseball players have a lot of these. Um, you read it, they got like an RBI and they got a, a batting average. Um, um, I think sometimes uh, when the doctor needs to be somewhere real fast, they say this, I feel like. Um, we need more stats. We need more stats. Here's my scale and the battery ran down. Wouldn't you know it? So I got to change the battery. Bear with me. Ba -ba -boop -ba -boop Button battery. Here's a Duracell 2032 button battery. Kudos to Duracell for making their button batteries almost impossible to extract from the packaging. Like me, excise some packaging here. I'll do some housekeeping here. There's a public service I wanted to do for you guys. It says it has bitter coating, like me, and it has a baby with a yucky face on the packaging. I wanted to see how yucky that battery was. Do you guys mind? Can we take a minute uh, in the midst of this mug review to see how yucky the battery tastes? Let's see. Bitter coating. Yeah, Blah. yeah, it's not good. It's not a good taste. I do not recommend you put a Duracell button battery in your mouth. The aftertaste isn't good either. Like me, mm. not good. Not good. 
Should I have been a hand model? Leave a comment below if you think so. How much does it weigh? 298 grams. That's 10.5 ounces. How thick is it? 9.4 centimeters. That's 3.7 inches. How tall is it? 2.2 inches. That's 5.5 centimeters. What's up, shoddy? You know, it looks like a little crock pot to me. So I feel if you were going to consume anything out of this, it should be something like a hearty beef stew or, in the absence of that, pork and beans. Let's see how much Van Camp's pork and beans and tomato sauce it can hold. 8.8 .8 ounces. That's 249 grams. Let's see what a serving is. 130 grams. Wow, I've almost got two servings there. One serving is 130 calories. Now we get to judge the tasting action. Bean Town, baby. Oh, hi Spankers. I'm the professional dad. My videos are so funny. Why am I relegated to my garage? Excuse me, my studio. I have to beg for likes and subscribes and ding the bell for notifications. Thank you for watching my video. I'm sure it wasn't a total waste of time. I'm sure you monitored your screen time very carefully and yet you chose to watch this video. You're a hero. That song that Carly Simon sang was about you. Nobody does it better. LOL, you thought I was talking about that other song. Well, until next time, keep your coffee hot and your- Hey, what's going on here?